Good morning, everybody. It is Lisa, and I want to come on and film an empties for you. Empties, ca empty candle, and a few waxes that I have. And before we get started, it is early in the morning. I look a hot mess. I said, I I just got up, um, what a half hour ago. Um, my hair is definitely, as you can see, a mess. It has a mind of its own. It wants to do what it. It wants to do whatever it wants. It still needs to be cut bad. I'm hoping to get it cut today. Um, I have my caregiver coming, or well, my husband's caregiver coming today to watch my husband just for a few hours. I have to go get a um, MRI done of my spine to see if I might have a pinched nerve. Um, if it is, hopefully we're able to take care of it and I can stop being in pain. Uh, right now, I'm having some hip problems. If it ain't one thing, it's another. I just wish it would stop. But anyway, I do want to come on and film an empty candle, definitely. Uh, I have a lot of empty candles I need to film and I need to take them to the recycle, which I want to stop and do that today before I head off to do my MRI. First thing, let's do the few waxes that I got. I'm just gonna throw them out here on my table. I was really, really doing a lot of candles this time. I mean, I, I was burning them. But I do have some waxes. I do have a couple of my wallflowers. I still have those. Um, now that I know that I can take the used wallflower plugins that stop working and trade them in and get another one, I'll still use them. But, and forgive the slightest is here. Yeah, I'm a little congested. But I do have... Uh, it is the season, and I have the Frosted Cranberry Holiday uh, Wallflowers. They're almost done. Can't wait till I change them out to something else. Uh, but I do like these smells. Um, I have the candles on them. I even went and got another Tis the Season for next year uh, candle, so I can use that for next year. So that was that. I do also have the Bath Body Works uh, Vanilla Bean Marshmallow. They're fragrant fragrance melt I have this one in my warmer in my bedroom um, I got this last year when they were having this semi annual sale uh, I think it was like a dollar something I spent for it because I'm sorry I'm not going to spend four dollars and fifty cents for this little thing no that's way too much money but I would spend a dollar something for it and I do have it in my my warmer in the bedroom, which I think I need to change it out now. I've had it in there for a few days. Um, it did smell really good. I really do like it. And I do like the smell of the vanilla bean. So this smelled good. Um, and I have one more of those, which I'll probably save. Then I have a tart um, from Yankee Candles. This is their cinnamon stick. I went ahead and I used that in one of my warmers, probably the one in the bedroom. So I love to smell of cinnamon during the holidays. And it smelled really good. And I think I might have a few more. I have plenty of tarts. When they were having their semi-annual sale, sometimes it, it was in 2019, I, um, I stocked up on them. And I have two of the cinnamon stick melts from the Better Home and Garden. I even think I have a couple more of these. Like I said, I do like cinnamon during the holidays, so I will definitely put them in my warmers and have my whole house smell of cinnamon. And that was that smelled really good. I had a fall leaf from Better Homes and Garden. I did like the smell. It smelled really nice. I had the pumpkin marshmallow, which was really nice. I did, and it's from Better Homes and Garden. That smelled good, and these were like two dollars, so I mean they're not bad in price. So I do get the cheaper waxes because um, the waxes don't really last long. It's just like the candles; I only buy candles when they're on sale, and I can get a coupon and I can get a deal from them. From them. That's the only time I buy them. But these were good. I did like them. Um, then I have the warm fall leaves from. Main Stays USA, I think if I'm saying that right, warmer, I mean a wax, and this was also good, I did thoroughly, I did enjoy it, it smelled really nice, 
And then I have the Sweet Apple from Mainstays USA. And this was also nice. Because I didn't do a lot of waxes this time because I was burning candles like you would not believe. I have a lot of candles. So, we're going to go ahead with the Vanilla Bean Noel. This one, you know, has the Vanilla Bean. I'm not sure we're going to have time. It has Vanilla Bean, Marshmallow Fluff, and Vanilla Cake, which is, it burned very nicely. It has a nice vanilla smell. It did, like, the blackness around here. Don't ask me why. Because I don't, when I blow them out, I do not put my top back on them because the smoke goes into the, the wax. It's melted. And then when you light it up again, you get that smoky smell from it. So I just leave the top off. But I don't know why it did this. But it did burn good. And it smelled great. Okay. I got a box with crates that I'm going to put these in to take them to the recycle. So I have to stop by the dump today and put them in the recycle. Then I have Give Thanks. This is, I believe was, I'm seeing it, the, yeah, the Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. This didn't burn as good as I thought. And this is a new candle. I just got this candle. Um, and it didn't burn as good as you see. And I couldn't get it to light. I couldn't get it to burn no more after that. But it does smell like sweet cinnamon pumpkin, which has warm cinnamon, fresh ground cloves, vanilla cream, brown sugar with essence oil. So this definitely smelled good. And I already have another sweet cinnamon pumpkin in my back room ready for next year. Okay. Then I have the fresh balsam. I tried to get another fresh balsam because I did like the smell of this and I wanted one for next year. As you see, it didn't burn as smoothly as I would like it to, but it does have a nice kind of pine scent. And I had that sitting out there on my shelf and you can smell it even in here. So it, it smells really good. You have to keep this away from you because um, it does have a... Um, strong scent. Let's see, it has woodland, balsam, chris, eucalyptus, fine, rich, b-r-a-n-c-h-e-s, then it has cedarwood. Hold that up if y'all can see it. And it smells good. Looks like it has a really nice fresh scent, a rush, fresh pine kind of scent. This is a the Candy Can Crush, which I already have another one that has the little fancier top. They were having a sale. I went to the sale. I had coupons. I probably wind up spending like $7.50 for this candle or $8. Um, it's the Crush Candy Can from the Elf Village. Um, burnt very nice. Liked it. It had a nice smell to it. It wasn't overpowering. I mean, um, I had it kind of like be kind of close to it a little bit to smell it at first. And then it did go to the house a little. I mean, it, it did have a very good throw, um, but it did smell good when you were by it, when you were close by it. It has the crushed peppermint, white sugar crystals, frosted mint leaf with essence oil. And it's very nice, and I already, I still have the fancier one that has the top, which I will put this away and probably um, display it next year. I don't know if I'll burn it or not. I just like it. I like to display it for like a little Christmas decoration. But this definitely was a nice candle, and as you see, I already have another one. I didn't want to burn that fancier one. I went, like I went and got this one to burn. And I have my favorite one from Village Candle, the Coconut Pineapple. I have two more of these backed up, and you can see that burns all the way down. There ain't nothing left of that candle. This candle smells so good. Got a little bit of smell to it still. I would have this out there on my shelves in the room out front. And I would light it before I go to work. And I come home and I'm walking up to the door and I can smell it before I even open the door. 
This candle smells good. I, like I said I have two more backups. I got it from Marshalls for $9.99. It's definitely worth the price. Um, if they come back with this candle again, because I think I got, I was shocked. I went a few weeks ago and I seen it and I picked it up. So that's why I have two of them now backed up. Um, but I would definitely purchase more of those because it definitely had a nice scent. It had a good throw. It smelled great. Then the apple cinnamon. Um, this was nice too. <laughs> from Village Candle. It had a light scent. Definitely nice. Um, these don't have what's in it, but it's apple cinnamon. So it's apple and cinnamon. Like, And this one was, I'm sorry, I don't know if I told you. This was the coconut pineapple. My favorite. Definitely love it. Definitely will stock up on it. If uh, when I run out and I find more, I will get more. Then I have this one from the Mainstay is cinnamon. I burned that. That was very nice. It's a cinnamon smell. I do love the smell of cinnamon. Make some of these candles off here. I'm sorry. They're starting to pop up. Okay. That's nice. I like the smell of cinnamon. It burnt pretty good. It had a nice throw. Um, I would definitely repurchase it. Then, I was wondering if I burnt this candle, and I did. The Vanilla Snowflake. I burnt this one. It burnt really good. Had a nice throw. Oh, it smelled so good. I wish I had another one of these, and I don't. Um, this is the Fresh Vanilla Ice Fig Fern. Ice Fern Needles. It's hard to see. Mint Leaf Coconut Flakes. With essence oil. Oh, it smells so good. I miss this candle. I wish I could have got another one because I definitely would have got another one for next year. Hopefully, I'll get one next year. Alright. Then I have my favorite, as always. I always get these candles. I have another one of this one. This is the Frosted, Frosted Cranberry. I have another one backed up of this one already. Eh, it just didn't burn as good as I would like, as you see. Is it an older candle? No, it's $24.50. It just didn't burn as good. I had a few of the newer ones didn't burn as good as I like. Uh, I cannot read this. I'm sorry. It is messed up. I know it says a cedar wood, but the bottom's all messed up. But it is a good candle. I'm pretty sure y'all have seen this candle because they do have it, and it really does smell good. Down there. Next, I'll put the tray on it. That's what I'm going to just take the whole box and stick it into the recycle. One. Then I have the peppermint marshmallow, which definitely was a nice candle. It burned pretty good. I got most of it burnt, and I couldn't get it to go anymore. All right, this has the old. This is a, a 24.50 candle. It has the peppermint, spearmint, powdered sugar, and marshmallows. It was made with peppermint and spearmint essence oil with a note of powdered sugar and marshmallows. This is definitely a nice candle. I did enjoy it. I don't like the twisted peppermint candle, but I did like this one because it wasn't so strong with peppermint. So I think that's why I liked it. And let's see, then we have the ice cranberry. A good candle. Burned good. It smells like frost. It smells like the frosted cranberry ones, but it's really nice. I did like this candle. It has, but this one has apple. It has fresh apple, fresh cranberry, sugar, raspberry, and creamy must. But it was a nice candle, and I think okay, this is twenty four fifty. This is a nice candle. I did like it. Um, if I see it again, I would repurchase it. Repurchase it again. Give me a minute. <coughs> I am still fighting this cold, guys. Oh, man. And I'm trying to hurry up so I don't make this video too long because I have a lot of candles. Mm. Told you, I've been burning some candles. Okay, let's go to the last tier here on my little candles. This is the Vanilla Pumpkin Marshmallow. It burns okay. Um, 
I already have another one of these. I purchased this when they were having a sale because I did did like the smell of the vanilla pumpkin marshmallow. It smelled really good. All right, it has vanilla, vanilla pumpkin marshmallow. It has some kind of vanilla. It has T A H I. I think that's L I N L I A N vanilla. Pumpkin spice, homemade marshmallow, drizzle caramel with essence oil. Let me see if I can hold that so y'all can see what, what vanilla I'm talking about. So that it was in here. I do have another one sitting over there that I purchased when we were having the sale. Because I definitely did like that smell. So I wanted another one. And then I have the, the perfect autumn. This was a new candle that I bought uh, 2019. It burnt like crap. You see that? I couldn't get it to stay lit after that. It burnt terribly. Like I said, this was a new candle I bought. It was $24.50. Um, it had a nice smell, but it just did not burn good at all. I don't know if I would repurchase this if it had if it has the same problem. But it has fresh cranberry, spice, spice pumpkin, crisp apple, red cloves with essence oil. It is it just smell nice, but it burnt terribly. So maybe it was just this this one. Maybe it was a bad batch. Um, but it just smelled nice. I did like it. I mean, I'll have to repurchase another one. And see how that one burns when they come back out with them again because they don't have any right now all right next is autumn this is a very good candle I purchased this year as you see it it burnt pretty good I mean it has some discrepancies in there but it did burnt very nicely I guess definitely have I did like this one I think this was my favorite when it comes to the autumn set it has bright red gale, G-A-L-A, -A, apples, juicy fig, eucalyptus leaf, fresh boss, no, I'm sorry, firm fig boss, what's F-I-R, bossum, there we go, with essence oil, and it's not quite, I would definitely get another one of this one, I don't have one now, but next, next autumn, I would get one of these because I did really did enjoy the smell of that candle all right next we're getting there guys tis the season which I already have another one of these somewhere I bought another one I bought a backup because I do like the smell of this it has some cinnamon smell it burnt pretty good it didn't have no problems the packaging was nice nice and crispy <laughs> All right, we have red apples, sweet cinnamon, cedarwood. That's it. That is all. You see this, guys? My hair is having a mind of its own. It wants to part there now. And I'm already thinning on the top here, so it's it's really it does that all the time now. But anyway, sorry. Um, but this was a good candle. I already have another one backed up for next year. Um, so I'm set for next year when it comes to tis the season. Then I have oh my cinnamon caramel swirl. This was pretty good. I finally burnt the candle that I had what was holding on to for a couple of years, and it, as you see, this one burnt pretty good. Has a little bit of problem as you see where the the wick moved. Who knows? Um, but it, it burnt nice. It smelled good. I did like the smell of it. I already have another one of these backed up for next year. Let's see if I can find the notes. Alright, made with cinnamon and orange essence oil with a note of caramel, vanilla, and maple syrup. And it smells good. I do like this. I even got an air freshener for my car uh, that I had and I used. And I like the smell. It smelled really nice. And I already have another one backed up so I'm set for next year and I believe this is 
the last candle that I have. This the little blue jar. I like this jar. I might keep this jar. This is the ass ass. Sorry guys. The ice vanilla woods. It's sweet vanilla. E B O N Y woods with ice lavender. It smells good. Yeah, it really smells good. And I like this glass. I think I'm going to refurbish this glass and keep this for something because this is really pretty. The texture, the blue. Oh, but it did burn nicely. And I liked it. It was really good. Um, I didn't see any this year because I definitely. Would have, I would have got some because this did smell this smells good but hey guys that's it we did pretty good we have 21 minutes um those are my empty candles I'm sorry I had to rush through this come on phone um because I wanted to hurry whatever my phone is doing but I wanted to hurry and get through this um sorry I had to rush um hope y'all like my little empty candle uh video. Alright, I'm going to get off here. Y'all have yourself a good day. The sun is starting to come up. I need to start getting myself together and start getting my husband ready. And I will have this, I will put this up as soon as I can. Alright, y'all have yourself a nice day everybody and I will talk to y'all very soon. Bye for now.